Hi, I'm John Storms, and today we have a special unboxing video because it is not Christmas lights. So let's go ahead and slice this guy open. And over here. See what we got. Okay. We have an order in from Department 56. And look what they sent us. Oh, look at that. Oh my word. I didn't even know they made catalogs like this anymore. This is going to be awesome. It's a Department 56 Christmas Town catalog. Okay, but that's not what we ordered. But that is a really nice gift. Really nice thing. So the first thing in the, in the box here is this Christmas vacation f figurine called Squirrel. And it's part of their Snow Village collection. Let's go ahead and open that up. Okay. Let's see what it says. National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation Squirrel. Not a children's toy. Okay. And it's a ceramic accessory. So we're going to open it up. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the foam packing. I, use, I like cardboard better. Okay. Slice the tape. That doesn't slice apart there. It slices apart at the top. Oh my goodness. All right. All right, now one thing I like to do when I'm opening these, I give a quick glance to make sure it's not broken. You know, I don't have to return it. But then I like to make some, some notes. Like, this is up. See that, the squirrel's here, so the squirrel. It's right there, and then this is the base. Then I'll mark this as the front. And people are like, oh, but that hurts resell. I'm never selling this, ever, ever. Christmas vacation, Christmas town stuff, no way, never selling it. All right, so let's pull them out and have a look at them. Uh -huh. Department 56. So here we have a Clark dressed in a Santa suit being chased by a squirrel. And he has like a pillow coming out there, which obviously wasn't in the movie. But these aren't super true to the movie. So anyway. That is him. Maybe we'll set him right here. With his packaging, with his box. Okay. Next one. I guess that's what knives are for. Okay, so this one is An Attic of Christmas Memories. Also part of the Snow Village collection. And this says ceramic and metal. Product details. Ooh, it has a battery. Okay, well, let's take a look. Mm -hmm. Again, with the foam packaging. Alright. Take a look. Oh. 
comes with a battery pack. Alright. Which I've never used. And then this appears to be the attic scene. Okay, it's not damaged, so let's go back in. And uh, let's see, so on this side, this is Clark. there and then this over here is the screen and then this is the battery And then that's the top. Okay, let's pull this out. Not that. We don't care about the better. We want to get a closer look at this. Okay, so let's see. We have Clark wearing the stuff he found in the attic. Holding what looks like to be old movies, sitting next to a projector, sitting next to an open box. And then on the screen it says Xmas 55. And I'm betting when we plug it in, the projector lights up. See, because there's a little LED light right there at the front of the projector. Yep. Okay, let's wrap this back around. Well, we're not putting them away yet, so we're going to put it right here. I want to get a picture of them, and they're all out. Okay. This one, I think, is going to be the best of the three. Okay. This one is Clark... Don't provoke them. You see, they have one of the previous pieces from another year in the background where they have the uh, the log truck with the car that slid under. Did you know that they are actually making trucks now where they have a piece of metal that hangs down from the bed of the truck to prevent a Clark, Clark Griswold incident from happening? Anyway, now this truck was um, in another movie. Oh, crap. What was it? Overboard? I don't remember. But anyway, this was in another movie um, that was popular. I think it had Meg Ryan in it, something like that. Anyway, um, not as good as Christmas Vacation. But just so you know, this truck has been in a few movies. Okay. Anything on the back? Nope. And this says Ceramic Accessory. So let's go ahead and open it up. This one is a little trickier. Okay, see this how they have all these old pieces that go in? Good luck taking this out at Christmas time and then remembering where every part, everything goes. So we're gonna say, so this is the hood. piece is the bed of the truck. Alright, so this is bed. Well, 
Oh, geez, front, back, okay. So we have hood, bed. Well, that should be good enough to figure out the orientation. And it's in its little bag. Pull it out very gently. Looks like it wants to come out. Back in first. Here we go, we go. Wiggle, wiggle. Oh, okay. That's all. It has a base. Pull it out. Ta da! There is the truck. Yeah, if you put in some eyes, it looks like it's from Cars Land. And it says dog on the front. Dog on duty. I kind of thought they would start coming out with the cars because the other thing I could see them coming out with, because Christmas Vacation just doesn't have a lot for Christmas Town, but one thing they do need to come out with are the two the uh, cars of the grandparents because in the movie those are actually pretty pretty nice looking cars. But anyway, so that's the truck. So these are the three items for this year. But well, before I do that, let me do this. So the other thing I do is I mark the boxes the year I got them. Again, this doesn't, if you're a collector, this is, you're going to scream because this is bad for resale. But like I said, I'm never going to resell them. So this is June 2024. All right. I like putting down for things, whether I got for a birthday or for Christmas or somebody gave it to me. I like to put down the, you know, when we got it. And then when you're unpacking your Christmas decorations, it's really cool. It's like, wow, this thing is like really, really old. Okay. So we'll do a quick picture of all the goods. Okay, there they are. We got Squirrel, Attic Memories, or whatever they called it, and Don't Provoke Them Clark Truck. Okay, uh, I need a picture. Okay, now we start the process of putting everything back away. All right. Do the truck first. I like to put the plastic bag back in. The side mirror's got to be careful. This could get ripped off. Hood. One for the bed. And the trick to keeping your Christmas decorations nice is putting them away each year and doing a good job, right? <clears throat> okay. Put the 
Clark and the Squirrel back. And then this is the base. That is the Squirrel. So I'll never have to worry about doing it wrong because I'll know. He fits in his box. Like that. As much as these cost, you wanna you wanna keep them nice. Keep them nice, you can enjoy them forever. put away until Christmas, which is only seven or eight short months away. So we have the Attic of Christmas Memories. We have Clark Don't Provoke Them Truck. And we have Squirrel. 